Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Just Rolled In. This customer had their Lexus RX350 towed in as they said it does not start ever since they changed their engine oil. The technician had removed the oil pan and found that it looks like the customer had never changed the oil. The technician also mentioned that the odometer read 26,000 miles, but once he plugged in the scan tool, he found that the vehicle actually had 90,000 miles on it, and the customer has owned this vehicle since new. This customer had brought in their car as they have a hard brake pedal and the check engine light is on. The technician found a pair of shoes behind the brake pedal, which he removed and affixed the customer's concern. Customer states that the AC vents in the center does not blow any air out of them. Ah, oh, that's nice. This is what's left of an engine out of a customer's Fiat 500. The customer had towed it behind their camper van, but left it in first gear the whole time, and was waved down by another driver who saw smoke come from their car. This vehicle was brought in for some brake work and an alignment, but the shop declined to do any work on it as the camper was chained to the frame. The technician said the whole vehicle was rather sketchy, so that's why they declined to do any work on it. And this customer's vehicle was only brought in for a recall. The technician noticed all four tires were bald, and some lug nuts were left loose as a customer had just installed their spare tire. The shop tried to get some used tires for the customer, but once their recall was performed, the car was left on the lot, and they never picked it up. Customer states they hear a grinding noise ever since they repaired their exhaust that was hanging down. And this technician had the airbag on this customer's SUV randomly deploy. They later found out that the customer had just recently bought this SUV, which has a salvage title. This customer's Ford Raptor was brought in as there was an issue with the electric power steering. While doing a visual inspection, the technician also noticed that somebody had tried to repair their frame on this truck, which he later found out that the customer had gone into an accident and had their son try and fix it. Customer states he can't adjust his ride height after he installed new coilovers. The customer never removed the factory coil springs after he installed the coilovers. And this customer had brought in their pickup truck as they left their dog in their vehicle, and he chewed up a bunch of the interior. Customer states he has a problem with his brakes after his friend replaced them. The technician found that whoever did the work installed the incorrect brake pads and covered the brake calipers in copper anti seize The mechanic who shared this clip said this customer came in as they said they had a rattling noise in their car. Customer states engine suddenly stopped. This is the oil filter out of a Ford Transit that hasn't had an oil change in 63,000 miles. The mechanic said the engine and turbo was replaced as they were both seized. And this person, for some reason, decided to pull up in front of this shop to change his oil, and also decided to drain all of the engine oil on the ground. This is driving down the street right now. This is what it must look like when a customer declines repairs and decides to drive home. I hope you enjoyed this video, and please consider leaving a like or subscribing if you haven't already. Thanks for watching.